is recipe challenge time. Jessica Hines is taking me on with her macaroni and cheese. Yes? First of all, good to see you. Tell me about macaroni and cheese. Macaroni and cheese start with macaroni. Yes. It's a form of pasta. Yes. In case you didn't know that. Uh -huh. It's pasta. Thank you. <laughs> it's a type of pasta. Okay. Now, why have you chosen what? macaroni and cheese? Because it's delicious, it's uh -huh. easy to cook, my kids love it. I feel yes. quite confident cooking it. Now, you know the blind tasters aren't children today, don't you? This is actually a slightly more adult version. And what makes it an adult version? What well, is it's got it? onion in it. Ooh, nice. Onion. I Grated like that idea. onion. So if you don't yes. like that, you might not like yeah. it. So Jess is making macaroni and cheese. Of course, I'm going to do macaroni and cheese. This one's going to be done with um, wonderful. Giro mushrooms, so a bit of a wild mushroom thing going on. Are you going to do any work today, or are you going to say... Listen, this is just, you know, I'm chilling here. I'm just making my... We're just watching you. <laughs> macaroni <laughs> cheese is, is, a, is a dish There's that you make when you have lots of children. So normally I'd be going, no, stop it, what? Uh, like come that. here, come here. That's why it's a good recipe. And You're just you... boiling the macaroni cheese there. You grew up in a bit of a sort of hippie household. What kind of things did you eat? Lots of lentils yeah. and yogurt, right? Lentils and yogurt. My mum used to make bread. Well, you're not a vegetarian, are you? I was a vegetarian after my son was born. I just went off eating meat, actually. Oh, really? Welcome um, back. And, uh, yeah, no, I got pregnant with my, with my daughter. Yeah. And, and, and I didn't even know I was pregnant. I was two weeks pregnant, and I was at a barbecue, and there was a big plate of spare ribs. And I would have eaten the person yeah. standing in front of the spare ribs if that's what it took to get to them. I didn't know I was pregnant at the time. Amazing. And then was, when, I, when I saw the spare ribs, yeah. my intense desire for the spare ribs made me think, oh, I'm pregnant, I must be pregnant. How extraordinary, yeah. amazing. Yeah. Macaroni's half cooked, and then I'm just going to glaze the pan, touch the white wine, and start making a really nice white wine cream sauce. My white sauce is, is basically like anybody else's white sauce, which right. is just melt the butter, put the flour in, yep. stir it up, and then I add, for this, not too much, but just a couple of inches of jerk seasoning, oh. which is kind of Caribbean uh -huh. seasoning. No flour in my white sauce, just cream, shallots, and thyme and girolles. Wow. Bring it up to the boil, and then I'm going to thicken it with this amazing cheese. I'm using Stitcherton cheese, which is quite sort of rich, um, very um, slightly salty, but mm. absolutely delicious. Perfect for macaroni and cheese. So, how did you start off in comedy? How did you get into it? Well, I, um, I, I was always being picked for comic roles at school. At like, school. I, I, we had a couple of teachers. They used to write us these little sort of um, plays. So I just kind of thought, oh, I can, maybe I can do this. There's a lot less female comedians than there are male comedians. Yes. Why is that? I think it's more important huh? for them to think they're funny. So. Yeah, which is weird, yeah. no? Yeah. I think it's because men just think they're funny, Jess. You know that? That's true, too. Yeah, in terms of that level of arrogance. Maybe women aren't as funny as men. I don't think that. I don't know, I'm wondering. No, maybe no. that's why. No. OK, so cream has reduced down now to this really nice mushroom creamy sauce. Season it with chives. And then... Egg yolks in. That will help it sort of glaze in the oven as it bakes. Parmesan cheese. Then we're going to add the macaroni back in to the cream, bake, and then win. I've just made a white sauce, nice and slowly, and now I'm um, grating red onion. So the onion's going raw. <laughs> You can sweat the onion off very quickly no, if you wish. No, I don't want to sweat it. Oh, you're going to it put sweats it... sweats when it cooks, and that's the point. The point is, you want a little bit of the onion. Right. You don't want onion. Oh, onion. And then, okay. finally, rest the macaroni in. Now, grated cheese on the top. That's it. Finito. I'm going to win. Right, so they both go in the oven now. Top where or bottom? Where do I put it? At the top? The where bottom? would you like to go? I would like it to go there. OK. No, actually, where are you going to put yours? Oh, God. I'm just asking. Where are you going to put All yours? All the heat's coming out. You, ladies first. You go first. Where are you oh, putting shit. yours? <laughs> hey, I want to put mine there top. too. Can they both go there? <laughs> of course they can. Okay. Of course they can. <laughs> yeah, I'm not. I'm not cool. <laughs>